Well, in the last uh, few minutes, the Health Secretary, Steve Barclay, has been talking about the strikes affecting the NHS and he said that he's keen to have dialogue with nursing unions. Let's have a listen. Well, I'm keen to uh, have dialogue with Pat Cullen and the RCN. I wrote to them last week, looking at the coming year, at the pressures from inflation and cost of living, how we could work together to make any settlement more affordable in terms of looking at what productivity opportunities there are, what efficiency opportunities there are, because there's common ground in recognising that the NHS is under pressure uh, and we need to respond to that. So I look forward to, to talking with the RCN and the other trade unions to see how do we make any settlement done through the independent pay review body more affordable? Where are those productivity and efficiency opportunities? I've written to Pat on that and I hope she but engages is 10, on it. Is 10% acceptable? Is that an acceptable figure? Well, the, the RCN actually turned down uh, an offer in Scotland which was 7.5% and significantly more than 10% if you look to the, the other things within that package. But the key thing is to look at uh, the coming year. Uh, the pay review body will be looking at the pressure of cost of living, the pressure on inflation, the scope for us to see how we make that more affordable by working together on issues of productivity, on issues of efficiency. I wrote to Pat uh, about that last night. I hope she engages constructively on that. It's important we work together to ensure that the evidence that goes to the independent pay review body for this uh, coming year reflects the pressure that the NHS is on, but also what is affordable to the wider economy.